My name is Pat McCrudden, and I live at 814 Spring Pines Drive, uh, just outside of Warren in Wethersfield Township at Westwood Mobile Home Park. Uh, starting the first week in January, they start building the road that goes down to the well site. Uh, that took about six weeks, and then they brought in a uh, rig for drilling. And uh, as they proceeded with that, we've had a lot of... Uh, a lot of ra rather lo loud noises. We've had a lot of uh, bright lights at night where it was lit up just like daylight all the way around the property and through my home. We've had uh, this put up with uh, chemical smells such as diesel fuel. And then after that was done, they started fracking and it was more of the same. A lot of noise, a lot of smoke, a lot of uh, uh, noise, lights again. And then recently, they let it rest for a little bit, uh, several weeks, and now they are flaring, and there's two pipes out there that are belching flames and smoke, and uh, now they are uh, trying to stabilize the pressure. They're reducing the pressure, and that's what's causing all the noise. And uh, that started at 2.43 this morning, and it hasn't stopped since. Uh, we've had to call the police. They had to go over and find out what was going on, and they were told by the officials over there and the Lordstown police that everything is fine, there's no problem, we don't have to worry about an explosion or anything, but uh, they're just trying to reduce the pressure in the well. Uh, but in the meantime, uh, sleep is very hard to come by, and it has been for some time when there's a lot of noise over there and lights. And... Uh, so now we're in the process of waiting to see what's going to happen here in the next few hours. Uh, we've got officials, uh, township fish officials coming to see us, and uh, we just want some resolution to this. We want to find out if there's really something seriously wrong over there, and how long is this noise, and how long is this process going to last? We'd like to have some sort of uh, end to this. And we don't want to wait years to have it. We don't want to be like some of the other uh, places in the country that have really had some horrible, horrific things happen. And we're quite worried. We're worried about our water. We're worried about the water that we drink that comes from the Meander Dam, which there are three wellheads over in the uh, uh, watershed. And that's how I got involved with it in the first place. I'd like to be able to drink decent water without it being polluted. Once it's polluted by these wells, it's forever. We've lost our water. So that's how I mainly got into it. And then it's just snowballed since then with all these other issues. So hopefully we can get some sort of resolution to this that's satisfactory. Uh, what time did you say that this started this morning? 2.43 a.m. Were you able to sleep at all after that? No. And I understand that at one point the neighbors were all congregating together? Yes. And what was the general feeling then among the neighbors? Well, they were scared and quite frankly they were mad. Is there, um, say it were to be a very bad problem, is there a disaster plan in place? We had a disaster plan in place by our fire chief, Randy Pugh, who's an excellent fire chief, I may add. And uh, it was taken out of his hands recently by our county commissioners. They turned it over to Homeland Security for the whole of Trumbull County. And we are not happy about that at all. We trust our local officials and we trust our fire department. They are excellent. That's why we voted for any levy that comes in, we vote for it. Has there, any, has there been any response from Homeland Security? We have heard nothing from them. We don't even know where they're located. If this blows up, how long would it take them to get here? Where are they located? We don't know anything about these people. But we're going to find out. Oh, yes, definitely. So there is some cause for concern. Now, you said that there was a local television news crew and a local official coming? Yes. Okay, and they're on their way now? Yes. Okay, excellent. Anything you'd like to add? No, I think that's about the basics of it. Uh... There might be more people come here as you're here that might add to it. But uh, 
I don't want to get long-winded about it, but you know, it's it's a cause for concern, and it has been from the day one. Yes, definitely. Well, thank you very much. Oh, you're quite welcome.